is like part of it, not just like you guys taking a time to like meet with each of the staff members individually, but like doing your job so well that the students are essentially doing it for the other parts for you. Mm -hmm. Another thing too is like I I've, I've met people at the middle school that have come to me and been like, I've never worked in a school like this before. Like why why aren't the teachers staying past three forty five? They're like, why aren't the teachers getting together on Fridays and like making pot like dinners and like playing mm -hmm. volleyball and like he's like there's no bonding between mm -hmm. the teachers here and like this is really bothering me. Mm -hmm. Um and I'm like, well, you know, like, you know, me and, like, Carla are always here until, like, five, six sometimes. And he's like, yeah, he's like, I'm not worried about, like, the time you guys are putting in. But he's like, there's so many teachers that just, like, I have to go home. Like, mm -hmm. I have to leave, like, right away. Mm -hmm. And um, I think, like, after school programs mm -hmm. can, like, play a big part in that. But also, you know, when we were forced to, to meet and, like, collaborate, like, science fair, mm -hmm. like, it ended up being, like, a really you know, fruitful discussion and, mm -hmm. like, work time that we had together. Mm -hmm. But maybe it's just, like, having those events where you have to, there has to be collaboration mm -hmm. between subjects or between grade levels of the same subject or something. Yeah. Because, I don't know, that, that worked really well for us last year. Mm -hmm. It's just having that one thing to, that one goal, that short-term goal to, like, mm -hmm. you know, coalesce around. Mm 